Oh, shoot. So Will Smith is back post, but um, he's a slave. So I I watched this trailer today. Like I started the trailer like excited. I wasn't even thinking about like post slap and stuff like that, but I was just excited to see another Will Smith movie because I'm I'm a Will Smith fan. I'm really I'm a Will Smith fan. So when I saw the thumbnail for this teaser trailer, I thought it was gonna be like a some type of like, you know, throwback war film or something like that. I didn't think it was gonna be another slave movie. And I do have to say before I get deeper into it, I'm not saying like we don't need to know our history, like us black people need to know our history. We know our history, we've seen this dramatized version of our history a lot. I, I went back and like counted. So from the 1950s to now, we had like, this is like a rough estimate, but like 30 plus movies based on American slavery. So again, I'm not saying like, we don't need to know our history, but I'm saying like, why, why are they keep making movies about this? Like we have other history. If y'all need to go outside of America to find like more stories, do that. But it's like, <sighs> all right. So this movie is based on a slave <laughs> called Peter. It's, it's based on a true story. You can look it up, but he um, got beat by a slave master then he ran away, went through the whole Louisiana swamp and all that. And then he joined, I think, some type of army don't, I don't want to say the wrong thing, but some type of army back then, he joined the army and someone took pictures of what happened to his back and then that kind of pushed things to stop slavery. It wasn't like the main reason slavery stopped, but it kind of like, you know, pushed it in the right direction to stop, to end it. That's why on the thumbnail, if you saw the thumbnail, this trailer is him like, you know, with his back turned, you know, of the guy taking a picture of his back. So that's like the, the gist of the story. I'm trying to see like, what are we going to take away from this that we haven't seen before? The thing that gets to me, y'all, the thing that gets to me, like two movies we got based on like, you know, kind of African history and Afri African American history is Woman King and this. This movie is directed by a black man and they pushing that, like even in the trailer, they'll show you like, I'm not even gonna try to say his name cause I don't remember, you know, no shade to him at all, but they say directed by a black man. And then they show Will Smith, a black man. But behind the scenes, this movie <laughs> is written by Bill. <laughs> and I bring up Woman King, cause I, I, I looked up Woman King, did a little research on Woman King, cause I was gonna like use that as an example of something good, I couldn't even do that because that movie was written by two white women. God dog. Like y'all remember FUBU, right? For us, by us. That's how I feel like these movies should be like for us and by us. So for us meaning it's something that we can take away from it that that we can like apply to our, our current lives and, and don't have to like look back and say, oh, that was sad. Oh, I want to cry. And then by us mean like written, directed, and acted by us. I hate to say this, I hate to make this like, cause it's not even a comparison, cause it's a fictional versus non-fictional story. Black Panther, the first one and the second one coming out, Wakanda Forever, is directed and written and stars like all black people. I may watch this, I may watch this and like have this be like the last slave movie I watch. Cause I really don't watch slave movies. I think the last one I, I watched was the one with um, Janae Monae. And, and that was kind of like by accident. I didn't know it was the slave movie, so they kind of tricked me into watching that. But I'm gonna watch it just to see if we get some takeaways. And if we don't have any takeaways from this movie, like it's, if you look it up, people are saying, oh, this movie's being praised and stuff like that. I want to see it myself. And then if I can say, okay, this is something I can apply to my life currently, then I'll, I'm, I'll join them in praising it. But if not, I'm gonna do a freaking review <laughs> on this channel and we gonna talk about it in detail, y'all. Trust me, trust me, trust me. But if you wanna check out the trailer, it's in the description below. But that's all I got, man, that's all I gotta say. Am I crazy, y'all? Am I crazy for thinking this? I, I talked to my wife about it before making this and she agrees with me. But am I crazy? Like somebody, <sighs> all right, man.